I said in the intro, 50 years you've been working in Give or uh, take a couple of weeks. All right, give or take a few weeks. That's not important. But for 50 years you've been working in comic book. Is that possible? I mean, did you do anything before you? I don't you think so. I, well, I had, I had other jobs before that. I mean, don't think I only worked in comics. Uh -huh. When I was in high school, I freelanced and I wrote, um, I wrote obituaries for people who were still alive. And uh, you know that's, that's how, a really good use of your time. Stan. You know, when, when a celebrity when a celebrity dies, uh -huh. about 15 minutes later, the newspaper comes out and there are three pages of write-ups about him. And you uh -huh. wonder how did they write it that fast? It's all there in advance. Exactly. And that's how you know you're famous. I would love to think somewhere, somewhere, my obituary, you know, is, is in a file somewhere. <laughs> then I'd know I made it. <laughs> I don't what want to see it too thought. soon, but that's okay. So it's written way ahead of time. Yeah. My it's, obituary could be written. Is that right? Somewhere well might be. out yeah. there it could be written somewhere? It probably is. You're probably in <laughs> files all over the country. They've probably country. run it a few times. <laughs> Who knows? All right. Well, the important thing, let's, let's talk about the comics because my brother, when I was growing up, my brother Luke collected uh, Marvel Comics, so I, I know some stuff about it. And uh, I know you've coming up, the big rivalry is between Marvel Comics and DC Comics. Oh, you're giving it away. No, it's true. Well, coming up soon, you guys are going to have the Marvel characters fight the DC characters, correct? We refer to it as the mighty Marvel Universe versus the DC heroes. And um, <laughs> You uh, bastard. <laughs> no, All right, well, let's talk about let's talk about some of the matchups. Superman versus the Incredible Hulk. Mm -hmm. Now, I would think Superman would kick his ass. I'm sorry, but Superman <laughs> Super Do you have any competitors competitive <laughs> shows I can deal yeah. with? <laughs> Snyder, just go. Uh, no. Um, no, no, but like Superman, he's good at everything, you know? And and, and he's su I always thought Superman was kind of a bad idea for a character because the Marvel characters are all good at one thing. You know, Spider-Man can climb a wall, you know, and the... He also uh, has a nifty, skin-tight outfit, you know, and, and how he I sees through that. those <laughs> white things, I, I'll never know. All right, but what I'm saying is then... then and he D shoots webs. Exactly, exactly, but DC invents this character, Superman, mm -hmm. who's good at everything, you know? He's mm -hmm. just like, he's super strong, he has supervision, he just, anything you name but it, he can do his, it. That's his Achilles heel. He is so unstoppable that they had to later on invent kryptonite because the stories were getting, nobody cared. There was they no, didn't worry yeah, exactly. about it. Exactly. How can you, you write a story about a guy who always can do anything right. better than anybody you else? You almost can't. See, right. that's why, says he, segueing into what he wants to talk about. Okay. That's why the Marvel <laughs> characters are so terrific. That's why the Marvel characters fallible. are so terrific. Like me, they have their faults. They have weaknesses. Okay, another matchup is going to be Batman versus Captain America. Mm -hmm. Who's going to win? In that one. Oh, not only the guys shouting out Captain America. <laughs> that there is greatness in your audience. Oh, now listen to this. Listen, yeah, that's right. You guys have Captain America. Now this one. I'm sorry. This one, Superboy versus Spider-Man. Now you're talking about a guy who can literally Superboy can can smash planets by hitting them really hard. Can he shoot yeah, a web? Oh, yeah, he can shoot a web, <laughs> Spider-Man. Hey, you do that very well. You well, know, we I haven't hired the guy to play the role yet. Really? That's right. Let's talk. Well, later. Um, <laughs> but Superboy versus Spider-Man, I would no, think that's... I have gonna... to confess something to you. Even if I knew who the winner was, I couldn't tell you, but I don't know. Nobody knows because the readers themselves are going to vote. See what it is. The oh, the readers can call up yeah, and say... No, no, they don't call. They have to literally vote. There are going to be ballots in the books. The books are going to be published uh, December, January, February, and March. In December, we introduce everything, and we learn how the Marvel Universe comes in contact with the DC world, whatever it is. <laughs> You know, I feel like I have to give equal time to someone from DC that's Comics. That's okay, that's okay. Nah, let's not do it. All right, this is just I, you. I, I like your attitude. Right. Then, the, um, let's see, uh, Spider-Man actually, he gets into Gotham City. Now, now, he's always in New York, you know, the real world. Right. But somehow our great writers have found a way to put him in Gotham City. He meets the Joker. Well, he, he just takes a penguin. cab or something. Yeah. What's the big deal? Are oh, you spoiling the whole thing? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Okay. And, and then in the next issue, the fights start. Now, Marvel is going to do two of the issues, and DC is going to do two of the issues. Okay. And we have these big battles with all our heroes against their heroes. The readers vote, and on the fourth month in March, we learn which universe triumphs and which universe is shattered. 
and you'll never see me again if it's the Marvel <laughs> Universe. <laughs> so yeah. drink me in while you can. You'll be out I mean, of the job. I mean, if it's the DC Universe. All yeah. right, well, it's going to be one of those tie things. It? <laughs> it's going to be a tie. When, yeah, when Superman and Flash had a foot race, it was a tie. It was a tie. It, it made Wasn't me really that mad. See, it's that's a the way when they it's do a tie. bad over DC. There. Yeah, I don't know. We would never. <laughs> <laughs> you would never do that. All right, well. I have no idea, though. I'm not writing these. Thank God I wouldn't want to have to write these. You just get the cash. Uh, well, not exactly. It's, oh. I share it with a few other people. <laughs> <laughs> like the rest of the world. You're on the good end of this thing. All right, well, let me mention the auction at Christie's East Saturday, oh, I should yes, mention, yes. is, uh, and of course, Marvel versus DC, right in. Fans mm -hmm. can do that. Stan, it was really good having you oh, on. Hey, it's, I enjoyed every bit of it. Stanley, everybody.